What's going on, ballers? Welcome to another episode of Beyond the Ball. And on this episode, we're going to take you into a live workshop that I did with the University of Texas at Austin, right? This was our second iteration of us showing student athletes not only why they need to have a podcast, but how they can create one in a short amount of time. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and cut, off, cut the intro and we're going to dive right in. Okay, so tap in to the workshop right now. Let's go. Beyond the Ball Podcast. Okay, so now, so now we're going to talk about how you can, you know, have a successful podcast in, you know, a little bit of time, right? A little bit of time. So now what I want you to do is I want you to, we're going to do, we're just going to do, so y'all in the front row, I want y'all to turn around. And then y'all in the row behind them, third row, I want y'all to turn around also. And I'm about to give you, I'm gonna give you the instructions when you're turned around looking at your person. If you're not directly paired with one person, I want you to find somebody to be paired up with. You're gonna be paired up with one person. Okay, we can. Does everybody have a partner? Is everybody paired? I want everybody to have a partner. Everybody needs to have a partner for this activity. We're talking about how to start a podcast, and this is a part of it. This is a part of it. Yeah, that part. Yeah, that part. Partnered up, partnered up, partnered up, partnered up. Okay, good, good. We good? Talk to me. Are we good? Yes. Okay, let's go. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to give you a, I want, does everybody, if you have your phone, hold your phone up for me. Hold your phone up. Okay, excellent, excellent. So this is what I want you to do. So the people who, whose backs are to me, right? So everybody whose back is to me right now, everybody's back. So that's row one and row three. I want y'all to grab your phone and I want you to go ahead and open the voice memo app on your phone. Come on, y'all showed up to the workshop. Grab your phone, come on, this is what y'all want. This is what you wanted. This is what you wanted, okay? Grab your phone, open it to the voice memo app and show me the voice memo. Just turn it like this so I can see it. I wanna make sure. Okay, great, great, yep, yep. Great, great. Just type, vo you should be able to type in voice recorder, or voice memos, and it should pop up. Perfect. So this is what I want you all to do. You all are going to, look, it's gonna go just like this. Here's a quick demonstration. Because I want you to ask three questions to the person who is in front of you. So you're gonna go one question, you're gonna say the question, then put the phone to the person's mouth and let them answer it. Then after they answer, then you're gonna say the second question. Then put the phone to the person's, you know, put the phone to the person's mouth, let them answer it. Then you're gonna say the third question, and then you're gonna do that. And then after, you're gonna push stop, and you're gonna put your phone down. And then when your phone is face down, that's how I know everybody's done. Y'all gonna have like, I'll give y'all a couple of minutes for this. Can we, do we understand? Do we understand the assignment? Everybody understand? All right, now uh, let me set my timer and yes, what's your question? It's on, it's, it's on, it's, it's on y'all. All right, I'm going to give y'all three minutes. I'm going to give y'all three minutes. Ready? Go. What's going on, ballers? You might be listening to this audio version of the podcast, or you might be watching even the video version of the podcast, and you're probably thinking, well, what would it take for John to come to our campus? What would it take for John to come to our school and to teach our students media training, to talk about podcasting, and even the whole world of media? Well, luckily for you, all you have to do, friend, is just click the link just down below in the show notes where it says, book John to speak, all right? And then we can go right there. We can set up time to have a conversation. And I would love to learn more about you, love to learn more about your student athletes and how we can serve and support them at a high level. OK, so just hit the link just down below and we look forward to having a conversation with you. Are y'all done in the back? Everybody's done. Y'all done. Y'all are done. Everybody's done. All right. OK, we're done. We're done. We're done. So now I want. I want one person to let me know. I want one of the people who was the interviewer, one of the interviewers. I want somebody to come up here and just share with me how was that experience for you. So that's somebody from row one or row three. Who was one of the interviewers? Somebody tell me how it was. Come on, come on, sis, come on. 
Come on now. You knew I, you knew I was going to pull you. Can we clap for her? Can we clap for her coming on down? Yeah. Okay. What, what's, what's your name? Vic. Vic, what's going on? Uh, nothing. Okay, cool. Cool. Uh, how, how was it? I was it? asking the questions, I was low-key interested in what she was saying. Like, oh, you were? What did you ask? I asked her if she had any siblings, what sport she played, and like her favorite color. Okay, so what sport she played, yeah. siblings, favorite color. What did you say her favorite color was? Green. Okay. Can we give it up for Vic? Yeah. Okay, so here's a, here, here's a, here's a small tip. This is, this is a little small tip right here. Uh, when, you're, when you're interviewing somebody, right, when you're interviewing somebody, What's that say? What does that say? Be curious. Y'all are killing me. One more time. What does that say? Be curious. Okay, there we go. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Because if you're actually curious, then you're going to listen more intently. And if you listen more intently, then that's going to let you know like what the next question could be, right? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay, so now... Now we're gonna. Now we're gonna switch it up. So now everybody and 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 I and I want you to uh, I want you to do it with your own phone, right? I want you to do it. So everybody who was in row one and row three, y'all did it with y'all's phone. So now row two and row four, I want you all to interview your pair. So get our phones out. Open the voice memo app. Get our phones out and make sure. Make sure as you're asking the questions, make sure that you're talking in the bottom of your phone where like the, where the speaker, not the speaker, but where the microphone is in your phone. So now it's, it's y'all's turn. We're going to set the timer. I'm going to set the timer for two minutes because some of y'all didn't take that long. So, but are y'all ready? Y'all got the voice memo app up? It's up? It's up, Jack? Solomon? Okay. Yep. All right. Y'all ready? That's so weak. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Y'all, let's turn this into like a game show or something. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Hey, let's go. Go. Two minutes. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, everybody, stop. All right, now I need somebody from... Come on down. Come on down. Talk to me. Let's give it up for her. Let's give it up for her. Let's give it up for her. What's up? Bring it in for the real deal. I know, right? You all right? Yes, I'm good. Yeah. What, so what, what, what did we learn? What did we learn? Or what, 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 what we feel? What we feel? Like doing the... When it, nah, this time. Oh. Yeah, from doing the interview. All that. So at first, we were talking in English, and then I ended up speaking Spanish to him, and we spoke to him exactly. We did the whole thing in Spanish, the whole interview. <laughs> Are you bilingual? You're bilingual. Yeah, I'm taking Spanish here. And I got oh, skipped dang. the last semester because I tested out. Really? Yeah, but we did the whole thing in Spanish. It was, it was fun. Okay, Spanish. that's cool. I asked him questions about like how it is, how he feels about UT and like being on the track team and the coaches, the teammates, and when he started running track. So it was cool. Can we give it up? For Okay, okay. All right, so this is, uh, uh, is going to be the second, just the second random tip uh, that you can learn from interviewing somebody. I'll just go right here. I'll just go right here. Let's see. Um, Did you all know that these were dry erased? No. no. Yes. Woo! Yes. Okay. <laughs> Help me out. Help me out. What, what, what does it say, class? Let's read it together. What's the first word say? Your. What's the second word say? Skillset. What's the third word say? Gross. I didn't know she spoke Spanish, but it doesn't have to just be that, right? Because the more you do anything, the better at it you become, right? Because, Jack, you say you throw the javelin, right? And you realize that you become better at it the more you throw it, right? Yeah. That's pretty... Yeah. So the same thing, um, same thing works with interviewing people, right? As you interview more people, you'll start to learn 
your way of asking questions. You'll start to learn how people respond when you ask certain questions. You'll start to learn how to ask a question off of the answer that they gave you, right? He spoke in Spanish, then you spoke back, and the next thing you know, y'all just... There it is, see? Wow. <laughs> That's so funny. That's funny. Okay, so... Um, since we're talking about how to, how to create a podcast and we're, since we're talking about how to do it in, in very little time, I'm going to let y'all know that there are some areas I'm not going to go into as much depth, but I'm going to leave time for questions and I'm also going to do like a little demonstration myself. But in order, to, in order to have what it takes to become a podcaster, you just have to be able to do what y'all did. So everybody repeat after me, say, I am... That was weak. Y'all got to be like, it's too many of y'all here for it to be that quiet. Say, I am, I am a, podcaster. a podcaster. This is why. Y'all, this is why. Because in order, in order to start a podcast at its base level in terms of content creation, you have to be able to capture the content. Right? Because I know Sam talked about video and all that, but I'm going to talk about audio for a second. You should have to capture the audio, and then you post the audio. Can, can, it, can it be that simple or no? No. It no, can't be that simple? It's not that simple. There's editing. There, it, there doesn't have to be editing. No, 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 no. Here's why. So here's my, here's my reason. Listen, here's my, here's, here's my reasoning why I'm breaking it down to you all like this. I believe that it's better off to get started and then perfect the process later. If I overcomplicate it now, y'all are going to walk out of here and say, I'm not going to do that. That's crazy. This dude is crazy. I ain't about to do this editing and that editing and all. You see what I'm saying? That makes sense? It's the attention span of our generation. I didn't say that. That's what you said. I didn't say that. Yeah. But, I mean, a lot of stuff can't keep my attention for that long either. So just so y'all know, the simplified version, right, at its base level, you record it and then you post it. Okay? Y'all got that so far? Yes. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Okay, cool. So look, now, now we're going to do, uh, well, now I'll just show you all the video version. I'll just show you all the video version. The video version, this, this, this might be more what you want, Lauren. What? I'm not going to make it that much more complicated. Yeah, see, there you go. But look, it's still not that complicated. No. So the first one, the first one was audio, okay? Podcast, somebody said, what is a podcast? A podcast, it, well, somebody last time, what they say? It was a recorded journal. Oh, yeah, a recorded journal, like a journal. Yeah, that's, that's what my man said last time. The guy was like, a uh, podcast is like a recorded journal. And I was like, that's a good point. We'll take that. We'll take that. So a podcast is an audio recorded journal, right? If we talk the video side, you record the video, right? So we go right here like this. Let me, let me, do, my, let me do my Sam Green impression. Hey, what's going on? We're at UT. This is a live podcast session. We're talking about how to record a podcast, and we're talking about how to create it, like, even if you don't have a lot of time. And we're only 10 seconds in, but I'm just going to post this just so you all can see the example. Everybody clap. Okay, so look. <laughs> so now I did that. Is it, is it okay with y'all if I just show a demonstration of what editing could look like? Is that okay with y'all? Do y'all want to see that or not? Y'all don't have to. Yeah. Okay. Okay, cool. Okay. I'm talking about my man. Yeah. All right. So look, this is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. I will show you a demonstration and and I'm not and I'm showing y'all something that I literally that I literally still do like now. Depending on how I feel about my time, I will still edit a podcast just like this. So, I'm going to share this file to this MacBook. And y'all are going to see it from there. Let me make sure we got our airdrop on. And then we will airdrop it. Okay. And so since this step is record, split, post, we already did the recording part, right? right. We already did the recording part, right? Yeah. Y'all gonna talk back to me. Uh, then we're gonna go here, and then, so this is, this the one I just did? Yep, today's 729. 
All right. So if you if you have a if you have a Mac on your Mac, you already have iMovie. So it's a free software. If you don't have a Mac, I'll, I'll explain another version that you can use uh, later. So we can go right here, create new movie, and then I just drop it. Okay. So that's the wrong way. I wasn't expecting that to happen, but yeah, we can flip it. Where's the one right here? So we just flip it. Y'all can see that? Yeah, we're good. Okay. So we recorded it. And then now, so in, in terms of a podcast, right? In terms of a podcast, so there's two components, right? There's audio and video. What are the two components? Audio and video. Okay, we're learning tonight. We're learning. So look, so now what I can do, well, for one, I can, since we already have the video, if I don't edit it, I can just upload that to YouTube, and then it's fine. Or y'all can take what y'all learned last week, if y'all were in that training, and you can cut it on CapCut. Uh, I'm not going to do that because I don't want to waste all the time doing that. <laughs> but you can just make those tweaks, make those little edits on CapCut on your phone, the free software, and you can post it on YouTube from your phone, post it on Instagram, post it on you know all those places. But in terms of doing it like the way I want to show y'all, so we'll go right here, and then what I'll do is, so first I will, where we go, where we go? Well, since it's video, I'll just go right here. I'm going to go export file, and then look, we have the option to do video and audio, right? So it's going to be together, because this is the video, and if we actually separated it, this would be the audio, okay? Y'all still with me? Y'all yes. Yes. sure? Yes. Some of y'all like I'm stressing y'all out. <laughs> okay, so look, we're just gonna go audio, and then the file format needs to be a MP3. What does the file format need to be? MP3. Okay, okay, we're still tracking. Then I go next, and then I say my UT podcast episode one. So we're gonna let that download. It shouldn't take any time at all because that's like 20 seconds. And then this is the next step, and then we'll be, we'll be good, okay? New episode, right? Mm -hmm. Then we go UT podcast episode. And then I'm not going to type nothing in the description just because time. Then we need to upload. What does it say we need to upload right there, Lauren? What does it say we need to upload? What does it say we need to upload class? MP3. What does it say we need to upload class? MP3. Okay, cool. Then we upload the MP3, my UT podcast episode. It's already uploaded because it was 20 seconds. And then I can hit publish. Then it goes through that process. This is trying to make me put in ads. Some of y'all who, you know, y'all have y'all's NIL going. Y'all can put in your ads with companies that want to work with y'all and stuff. When y'all like broker deals, y'all can like talk with them about putting ads in there, and y'all can get them to pay you on, on that. Uh, I, don't, I don't have that opportunity no more. So we'll just go, I'll just hit this, and just move on. But after that, okay. I don't know why I was trying to make me do that. Uh, and then, We're good. The episode is live. The episode is live, y'all. So, does that, does that seem complicated? It's not a trick question. Does that seem complicated? No. Does that seem complicated? <laughs> no, he should have said He said no. So, okay. So, now... Um, so I made you all interview each other at first with no preparation, right? And I know some of y'all asked, you know, which favorite color, where are you from? So some of y'all might have asked general questions, right? But if you had more time to interview your table mate or your teammate, do you think you would ask deeper level questions? Y'all think so? Okay, okay. 
Who, who has an idea of how you would prepare if you had, if you had like a little bit of time to prepare for the interview? What, what would be one route you would think about going to prepare? You look like you want to, sh you look like you want to shoot your hand up. Yeah. You was like this. You did this. You didn't? You sure? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, brainstorming ideas. Anybody else? How could we prepare? How, how do you prepare for a job interview? Research the person. Okay. Anybody else? Practice. Practice. This is good. This is good. Anybody else? Okay. Okay. This is good. See, y'all don't even need me to come do the presentation. Y'all got it all the way. So, so, since y'all already went through and y'all already rotated and everything like that, we already did the where I did the mock interviews. Oh, I got the clicker. We already did that. I want to just share with you all. But we already rotated. So this is how to prepare to interview other people, but this is also how you can prepare for an interview yourself, right? And the same way that you prepare for about to get interviewed on a podcast can be the same way that you prepare for like a job interview or whatever else it might be. If you know that you're going to be on somebody's podcast, right? Like if I know I'm about to be on your podcast, Jack, I would go back and I would look and see what, what other type guest has Jack interviewed? Who was the last guest that Jack interviewed? So then when I come on your show and you're like, John, it's great to have you on the show, and da 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 And I'll be like, man, Jack, thanks for having me. It's a, it's a privilege, man, to be here. And man, it was pretty cool when you interviewed Solomon. That's probably one of my favorite episodes. And you'll be like, oh, OK, cool, man. Thanks for checking out the show. You know, it's just one of those things that it just sets you up for success, right? Because you're able to be prepared as opposed to like getting caught off guard type deal, right? So here's a few tips. So I believe that you should utilize YouTube to the best of your ability. Anybody here, this isn't even on there, but does anybody here use AI at all? By a show of hands, any of y'all? Chat GPT, y'all use Chat GPT or y'all use a different one? Have any of y'all heard of Google Gemini? Y'all put Google Gemini to work? Y'all like Google Gemini better than Chat GPT? You do? Google, yeah, yeah, my man on it. I mean, like, yeah, I was, duh. So look, so, so we have, so you can, I, I would suggest, I would, let's just do this. Let's, let's do this, Dr. Sobers. This is what we're going to do. Okay, so, so let's say that I am going to interview, let, let's, let's say that I'm going to interview, I don't know. I, I, I'll just say, let's say that I'm going to Interview, interview, if I'm going to interview Muhammad Ali, right? That's good. Okay. Is this helping anybody so far? Yes. Is this beneficial? Yes. Okay, cool. So let's say that I am going to interview Muhammad Ali. Okay. Let's just say, what are 10 questions that I could ask Muhammad Ali for my podcast? What's going on, family? Uh, if you enjoyed this content, I need you to stop right now. Stop what you're doing. And I need you to smash that subscribe button, all right? Smash that subscribe button and then drop a comment just down below. Like, what did you like about the video? What can we continue to improve in terms of our videos? Or even what are some topics that we can cover on this platform, all right? So do those two things for us. Smash that subscribe button. I'm gonna pause for a second. Did you hit it yet? If you didn't, smash that thing and then leave us a comment because I would love to hear from you and I would love to interact with you. My man in the back, what's your name, sir? Yeah. Come up here, Pierre. Please come up here. Can we, can we give Pierre a hand clap as he comes? Come on, Pierre. So, I'm, so I, I wanted to bring Pierre up here just because Pierre, Pierre said he'd be on Google Gemini, man. I just wanted to bring him up. So Pierre, man, do, do me a favor and just read, just read, the, just read two of the questions that, that you like. Two of the questions that you like and that you would ask Muhammad Ali if you had the, if you had the chance to interview him. What, what would be two of the questions that you would read from those 10? I like the first one. What inspired you to become a boxer and how did you develop your unique fighting style? Do y'all think that's, a, that's an interesting question, right? Yeah. That sounds like somebody took time and thought about that, right? <laughs> man, give, give me another one, Pierre. Give me another one. What's another one? Reflecting on your remarkable career, what do you hope people remember most about Muhammad Ali, both inside and outside the ring? Can I give you some depth? I like that one too, man. I was looking at that one too, man. Yeah, you are. Good job, man. 
Go ahead, can we get up Pierre one more time? Thanks, man, awesome. So let's say that you're busy. Let's say you had a track meet. Let's say that you had a rowing competition. Let's say whatever it was, right? You didn't have time to think up questions. I know we're not gonna make a habit of this, but let's say you didn't have time. Then you can use ChatGPT. But then watch this. We don't like these 10 questions. Give me 10 more. Of course, here are 10 more questions for your podcast with Muhammad Ali. It's asking about his daughter. Your daughter, Layla Ali, followed in your footsteps and became a successful boxer on, your, on her own right. What was it like for you to see her pursue a similar path, and how did you support her along the way? What? That's a great question. Oh my goodness, Vic. That's not a good question? That's impre isn't it? Oh my goodness. Then it says, what else? Let's see. Da, 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 da. Okay, wow, this is good. Your Parkinson's diagnosis in the 1980s presented a new kind of challenge. How did you cope with the physical and emotional toll of the disease while still remaining active in public life? What are we talking about here? This is amazing. Get Chat GPT out of here. This is crazy. So now, so now you are, would you just, just, say, just say yes as I ask you these questions, because I want to make sure, I want to do, do a pulse check, Dr. Sober, just a quick pulse check. Okay, so just pulse check, we'll make sure we all alive, we all still here. So um, do you all know how to create a podcast, audio, do you know how to create an audio-only podcast? Yes. yes. Okay, Reginald. Do you all know how to create an audio and video podcast? Yes. Do you all know how to come up with questions to ask your guests for a podcast? Yes. Man, did that take that much time, y'all? All right, family, until next time, peace and God bless. This is Beyond the Ball, where we help student-athletes succeed beyond their degree.